I took a photo of a pheasant berry flower in the garden and I wanted to carve it. So I decided to make a chip carved frame and then carve the pheasant berry, paint it and put it on top. If you want to see how I did it and learn more about the chip carving, then uh, keep on watching.
I've got these items that I designed and chip carved recently. This is from an old piece of door frame and the carving, the reason it's that size is because it's going to be glued on top of this frame. Then I also got this owl that I designed and this star. You can get all these three patterns in my Skillshare class uh, where I show you how to make this particular star with uh, just a bench chisel. So I thought that might be a thing that people might want to learn. So if you look down in the description you can see the link to the Skillshare class and uh, have a go at it. So here's the final result in a bit more detail. The top section is made from lime wood, also known as linden wood, and uh, I think basswood as well. I think they're all kind of related, or perhaps even the same plant. You can see there's uh, quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of depth there. I mean, I could have even used more wood if I wanted to. Um, and the back is made from a chip carved piece of mahogany. I think it's mahogany, from an old door. Um, I know you didn't see me do the chip carving in this video, but there's a good reason for that. It's because I have a Skillshare class currently where I'm doing some chip carving. You heard me mention it earlier in the video. Um, here's the owl. And here's the star. This is what we learned to make in the video, the star. And this is the actual star from the video. So this is just a piece of pine. And I used just a normal chisel to make it, just a, a normal flat bench chisel. In fact, it was this one right here, which is a 13 mil or half inch chisel. Um, we made that whole thing with that. So if you'd like to take part in that class, then feel free to go down to the description. There's a link to it there. Otherwise, thank you very much for coming. Uh, I really appreciate the support and you guys watching my channel, as always. Uh, if you feel like someone would like this video, feel free to share it around. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to do that as well. <laughs> and uh, hopefully I will catch you again in the next video. Thanks a lot.